Hello? Why are you ignoring me? What is it, Lily? Can't you see I'm getting ready? <laughs> ready, Mia? Start with a half face of makeup. Draw a line to separate the other half. Grab some purple eyeshadow and add it around the eye. And now, yellow. Next, use liquid latex to help the tissue stick. Don't be shy, add more liquid latex. And wait to dry. Use red face paint for the veins. Cut a slit down the middle of the tissue. Be careful! Add black lipstick all over the skin area inside the tissue. We can't forget red lip gloss to add blood. Now foundation. And more purple eyeshadow. And last, the blood. Wow, so pretty, Mia. Pretty scary. Your date will go running. See, it's just makeup. Ew, it looks so real. Isn't it perfect for the party? The party? We still need to decorate. Let's go. Say hi to Max. Are you ready? First, apply white face paint all over your face. Then, use blue eyeshadow and draw triangles over and under the eyes. Use black for the nose, then blend with red. Add the wrinkles, then contour. Don't forget the coconut oil and apply onto the hands. Put the scar wax on to extend the mouth. Blend out the wax. Apply face powder and paint white. Use red eyeshadow and color. With a pencil, make a slit in the wax. Color the slit with red face paint and add scab blood. Paint the lips and add a bit of fake blood. What a creepy smile! across the face and the neck. Now add glue cause it's time for prosthetics. One on the mouth and the neck. Add more glue. Looking creepy already, Stacey. Next, foundation. This will blend everything out. Add black face paint around the eyes and brown paint all over the face. Color the lip area black. Use purple face paint for a spookier effect. You can't forget the pin! Use liquid latex to make everything stick. Now add red lip gloss to the wounds. You can't forget the blood. Don't be scared to add a lot. Add white dots with white face paint for butts and eyes. And the last finishing touches. A voodoo doll? Don't curse us all, Stacy. <laughs> what should I prank Stacy with next? Huh? Who's? <laughs> <laughs> That's what you get for scaring me, Stacy. Oh, you're a genius. I know. Now stop messing with me. I just gotta think of better pranks next time. <laughs> Ready for a makeover, Tony? Start by applying eyeshadow around your eyes. Make sure you blend it out. Now, take parchment paper and add hot glue drops. Apply concealer and blend. Now, add 
add yellow eyeshadow to make them look like blisters. Apply it in batches around your face. Then add red eyeshadow around the blisters to make it look more realistic. Take black eyeshadow and draw veins coming from the blisters. Put non-toxic glue onto a sponge and apply around the mouth. Put a tissue on top. Add more glue on top and another layer of tissue. Put on foundation. Then poke a hole and split it. Take black face paint and apply it to the mouth area in the tissue. Paint the insides of the tissue red. Now apply liquid blood to cover the edges of the tissue. He looks like he's straight out of an apocalypse. What's wrong? Why are you crying? I have a day with Grim Reaper today and I have nothing to wear. Huh? Really? I can't believe you're not even listening to me. Becca, hold on. I have an idea. Let's get started, Becca. Looking cool. Now, with purple face paint, cover one eye area. Next, use pink face paint to cover the other eye, the brain, and the mouth area. Don't forget white paint for more details for a spookier look. Now, use dark green paint to contour your nose and cheekbones. With red lipstick, color the eyebrows. Nice! Time for the bones! Next, using eyeliner, trace the brain and the eyebrows. Add color to the lips. Cute! I mean, spooky! Trace the lips and the teeth! Don't forget the bones and the skin! Yuck! Add white face paint to the lines to make everything pop up. One last touch! Perfect! What a creepy zombie you make, Becca! Oh my monster, this makeup looks awesome. Grim Reaper will love it. I'm glad you like it. Thanks so much. Oh, he's here. Bye, Lily. Have fun. Hi, Lily. Let's start this makeover with face paint. Color the upper portion of the face blue. Then cover the upper forehead with purple and draw lines coming from the forehead. With the wig cap, apply eyeshadow for the scales. Now draw the jaw. Color it black. Time for the sharp teeth. Use white face paint to draw the teeth and use black paint to separate them. Don't forget the lower mouth. Outline the jaw with blue. Apply eyelash glue to black gems and add them to the forehead. Add more scales. Ready for Lily's look? Lily looks like she belongs in the ocean. Hey Stacy, are you ready? Start by adding fake eyelashes. Cover the hands of coconut oil to prevent the wax from sticking. Apply scar wax to split the face in half. Cover the wax with powder and foundation to match the shade of the skin. Paint half of the face white. Then color the eyes black and use eyeshadow to blend. Then use the eyeshadow to draw a jawline. Make the teeth brighter by coloring them white. Blend out the edges. Apply red eyeshadow onto the wax and use a pencil to make a slit down the middle. Add red eyeshadow in the cut, then the scab blood for a scarier effect. Dab on some liquid blood onto the cut. A grim reaper? You look out of this world! Amy, get ready. First, paint your eye bags white. Then, apply eyeliner and outline the edges. Use eyeliner to draw fake bottom lashes. Be generous with the blush and apply it all over your cheeks. And don't forget the freckles. Draw lips using paint. Use black face paint to draw a big hole. Now, draw cracks coming from the hole. Don't be afraid to be creative and draw cracks all over the face. Apply white paint for more dimension. With parchment paper, create teardrops. Finally, add fake blood. Amy, you don't even look human anymore. What do you mean I'm not allowed at the party? I'm wearing this pumpkin shirt. Isn't it cute? 
Sorry, Amy, it's a costume party. Yeah. Oh, man, I guess I'll come next year then. Oh, wait, Amy, I know what to do. Really? Hi, Amy. Let's start with foundation. <laughs> Combine red and orange eyeshadow. Then, draw vertical stripes all over the face. Grab brown face paint and trace over the orange lines. Use black face paint for the eyes and draw triangles. Trace over the orange lines with black face paint. And last, the eyelashes. Whoa, Amy, you look exactly like that jack-o'-lantern. <laughs> wow, thanks, Mia. Now can I come to the Halloween party, Lily? Yeah! Yay! Let's party, guys! Woo! Ready for some spooky food? Wrap a skull in plastic wrap. Then, cover it with prosciutto. Cut slots and add green olives as the eyes. Fill it up with more snacks and it's all ready. For this scary candle, remove the front of a skull. Then, cover with school glue and glitter. Take a toilet paper roll and paint. Put the skull on top. Paint the top of a candle and glue it to the roll. Cover the edges with black hot glue. How spooky! To make some scary decorations, first paint a basket. Now cut off the edge. Place a creature in there. And glue on top. Next, add a handle. Then the chain. And done! Take a scary picture and cut off the edges. Then place the picture onto a frame. Flip it over and spray with looking glass spray. Put the cover back on and now you have a creepy mirror. For this spider, split the styrofoam ball in half. Now, time to make the balls of yarn. Then, glue them onto the styrofoam ball. Attach the head. Time for the legs. Attach it to the body, then bend the legs. Last, use red hot glue as the eyes. It's moving, how creepy! Paint a doll white. Then, carefully color with gray and red paint. Now, paint the eyes. Next, the black veins. Hang up the doll and you can scare anyone. Vampire, is that my food? No, I don't think so. Let me see. It is mine! Give it back! I'm sorry! Uh, vampire's always stealing my food! I know what to do! I'll use this hole puncher and this clear cord to make a sliding plate. First, punch a hole into the plate. Now tie it with a string. Make sure it's tight. Perfect! Time to go prank Vampire, let's go hide! <gasps> Ooh, did Ghost Lady forget her food again? She won't know that I took a piece. Huh? What's going on? <laughs> I knew she would try to steal again. Huh? Did the plate just move? Nah, it's just my imagination. Ah, it did move! It's a ghost! <laughs> I got her good. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you get for stealing my food, vampire! Ghost lady! Where are you? Ghost lady! A zombie in here! Oh, I found you! I spent all day looking for you! Oh, my arm is so itchy! Oh my 
a monster. I've been here the whole time. What happened to your arm? I don't know. I think it's a rash from one of the trees. Oh, uh, you always have a problem, but I can turn it easy with apple cider vinegar. What? You just need to apply the apple cider vinegar onto the rash. The properties in apple cider vinegar reduce inflammation. Apply it three times per day and the rash will be gone. Well, thank you, ghost lady. My rash is gone. No problem, zombie. Now let's go meet Frankenstein. Okay. Vampire, happy Halloween. Thanks, but what is this? It's a Halloween lamp. You can put it on your desk. Thanks for the Halloween lamp, witch. You're welcome. I'm gonna go visit ghost lady. See you. Okay. Why does she always give me weird stuff on Halloween? What is this? I'm gonna take a nap. <sighs> huh? Vampire. Oh, it's just the lamp that witch gave me. Why is it so scary? Oh, just put it over here. <sighs> Back to bed. Huh? <laughs> oh my monster! I need to get rid of it! I can't sleep! Uh, now I won't be able to see it so I can go to sleep. <sighs> I'm watching you. Ghost lady, I have a package. I'm busy. Can you just leave it there for me? No problem, ghost lady. Oh, oh my arm. Huh? Are you okay, zombie? Oh, no, I'm not. I was scraped. Look. Don't worry, zombie. I can help you. Magic! To treat your scrape, all you need is a cotton ball and coconut oil. Use a cotton ball to grab some coconut oil. Then carefully apply it on the scrape. The coconut oil can reduce infection and moisturize the scrape. Just do it two times a day for a week and you should feel better. Wow, my scrape is all gone. Thank you, ghost lady. No problem. Can you help me to organize the boxes? I'll check them later. Okay. Oh, ah! Ah! Ghost lady, don't scare me like that. So fun, you're so easy to scare! <laughs> oh. ah! uh, again? Why do you keep scaring me? It's because I'm trying to make you a tougher monster! Oh, I don't want to be tough! But you have to be! <laughs> Ghostly is always trying to scare me, I hate it! Oh! I'm gonna use this eyelash glue and this fake nail to scare Ghost Lady back! Put the nail on my lip, then apply eyelash glue. Huh? Lastly, add some red huh? lip gloss to make it look like blood. Huh? Oh, this looks so good. Now time to scare Ghost Lady. Ghost Lady, help! Help! Ghost Lady! Huh? What happened? Ah! What's wrong? My lips, I got a nail stuck in it. Ah! A nail? How did that even happen? It hurts so bad. Just have me take it out. Ah! I'm sorry, vampire. I just don't like blood. Ugh. <laughs> Got you. It's just a fake. <laughs> it's a fake nail, see? And I guess you're not so tough either, ghost lady, huh? What? A fake nail? You got me good. <laughs> yeah, I did. <laughs> oh, my monster. I hate cleaning up. Quit complaining and keep cleaning. <sighs> Why is there bugs everywhere? <laughs> huh? What's wrong, zombie? Oh, my monster. A bug bit me. Ooh. Oh, what am I gonna do? I look so ugly. Don't worry, zombie. I can help you. Ooh. To get rid of mosquito bites, all we need is chamomile tea. First, take the tea bag out, put it in a pot, and add hot water. Just wait 15 minutes, then take the tea bag out. Carefully apply it into the mosquito bite. The tea can reduce inflammation and speed up healing. Just do this three times a day for two days, and you should feel better. Oh wow, my nose is all better. Thank you, ghost lady. No problem, zombie. Now help me clean up. Okay. No! Who ate all my pickles? Oh, I have to catch the thief. And I know just how to do it. First, I need some pictures. Oh, perfect. Now, put the picture in the jar. Oh yeah, this looks scary. Now, let's put the picture of the pickles onto the other side. All right, this should scare whoever's been stealing my pickles. Hey, hello. Do you know who's been stealing my pickles? Oh, pickles? Uh, no, no, I, I don't know. 
It better not be you. Oh, I have to go. Okay, bye. -bye. <sighs> Luckily, she didn't know I was lying. Ooh, a full jar of pickles. She won't know if I just took one. Witch! Ah! Huh? You called me? Huh? I saw your head in the jar. How are you here? It's called magic, and I caught you. You're the pickle thief. Give it to me. It's just a picture, see? You'll never steal my pickles again. <laughs> hey, ghost lady, are you ready for the monster party? Yes, I'm always ready. Wait, hold on. Your teeth look so gross. Excuse me? Are you serious? My teeth look so good. Look. I'm serious. You can use a mirror to check. Oh, my teeth are so green and gross. What am I going to do? I can't go out with these teeth. Don't worry, ghost lady. I know what to do. To clean your teeth, all you need is one banana. First, peel the banana. Now, I'll eat it. What? Are you serious? How are you going to treat my teeth? Don't worry, ghost lady. You don't need the banana. You just need the banana peel. The citric acid in the peel will help whiten your teeth. Do it every day for one week, and you'll have bright teeth like mine. Wow, zombie. My teeth are so bright now. Thank you. No problem. Now let's go to the party. OK. Witch, stop playing games and help me move these boxes. Give me a minute. I'm almost done. Oh, whatever. I've been cleaning all day, and Witch is only worried about playing games. Ugh. Oh, Witch, still playing games? Oh, uh, yeah, I'm almost done. If you don't help me with these boxes, you're not going to the monster party later. OK, OK, just give me two more minutes, and then I'll move the last box. OK, fine, but you better do it fast. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I can't believe I brought these all by myself. Oh, I'll prank Witch. <sighs> when Witch comes by the boxes, I'll jump out and scare her. <laughs> Oh, yes, I won. I got to get rid of this box so I can go to the monster party. I hear her coming. I'm going to get her so good. <laughs> oh, man, this thing's so huh? heavy. Whew. I'll go get ready for the monster party now. Oh, no, the box is too heavy. I can't get out. Help. I'm stuck. Anybody help. Oh, my monster. There's a nail in my hand. Help me, help me. What happened? To make the nail through hand, first add eyelash glue onto the fake nail. Then I'll attach it to your hand. For the next step, you need a Q-tip. Use it to take some scab blood for a scarier effect. Now apply it to the base of the nail. Wow, it looks so scary. Thank you, zombie. No problem. Now let's go scare Frankenstein. Yeah. Get it off, get it off. Relax, witch. It's just a fake spider, see? Uh, I don't care. I hate bugs. Wait, aren't you a monster? Why are you scared of bugs? It's because they're so ugly and disgusting. Ugh. I'm out of here. I can't believe her. Ugh. She thinks my spiders are ugly and disgusting? I'll show her. Ooh, she's not in her room. I can sneak in. I know just what to do to prank her. I'm a prank witch by putting spiders in her lamp. <laughs> I'll take one here. And another one here. And the last one right there. Awesome! Now when she's going to turn on her lamp, she's going to see spiders. <laughs> That's what you get for calling my spiders ugly. <sighs> I'm so tired. It's time for bed. Oh, I forgot to do something. Spiders! Why is there spiders in my room? Oh, get away! Get away! What happened? Oh, there's so many spiders in my room. Look! <laughs> a prank. You're such a scaredy cat, witch. <laughs> Are you serious? Yeah, look. See, it's fake. You gotta be more tough. You're a monster. Uh, I guess you're right. Here, try touching it. Uh, is my oatmeal done, ghost lady? I'm so hungry. Just give me a few minutes. I still have to cut the apple. Hurry. Ah. Huh? What's going on, ghost lady? Oh, uh, you accidentally cut my finger. What am I gonna do? Don't worry, ghost lady. To treat your problem, all you need is lavender oil. When you have a small cut,
cut, just apply lavender oil on it. It will cut down on pain and keep infections away. Next, use a band-aid to cover the cut. Redo it three times a day. In two days, you'll feel better. Wow, thank you, zombie. My finger's okay now. No problem, but can you make me the oatmeal now? I'm so hungry. Oh, no problem, coming right up. Thank you. Oh, it's so high. How can I reach it? to take the decoration and it hit my arm now I have a bruise. What am I gonna do? Zombie, I've already told you to be careful and use a ladder. But don't worry, I'll help you. Yes, please, it hurts so much. Zombie, all you need is toothpaste. What? Yeah. Apply toothpaste onto the bruise. The toothpaste helps to break up clots and increases blood flow to the bruised area, reducing swelling. Leave it for an hour, then wipe it off and repeat for two days and your bruise will be gone. Well, thank you, ghost lady. My bruise is gone. No problem, but remember to use the ladder. Okay. Mm, I love spicy noodles. Zombie made noodles and didn't invite me. Ugh. Zombie, you're still sitting here? Franken sun your favorite singers outside. What? Really? Yeah, hurry. You might miss him. Oh, my monster. I can hear my idol now. Yeah. Now I can eat your noodles. Mm, oh my monster, it's so hot! What, what happened, ghost lady? It's hot, this noodle burned my mouth! What, you ate my spicy noodle? That's what you get. I'm so sorry, but can you please help me, it's hot! Okay, it's really easy to treat a burn. All you need is honey and a spoon. First, pour out some honey into the spoon. Then, you just need to eat it. The honey will absorb the oils, making your mouth spicy. Do it for five minutes, and the burning will be gone. Wow, you're right, my burning is gone. Thank you. No problem, but next time, don't eat my food. Oh, okay, here, here. Uh, thank uh, you. Sit down, sit down, come on. Okay. Look, careful, they're spicy. Yeah, I know. Do you want me to feed you? Oh. Oh, this paint is cute. I was craving this this morning. I want three of these chips. All oh, these chips look good too. And this bowl. Oh, are you ready to check out? I don't even need to check out. I have a bunch of diamonds. Diamonds? What do you mean? I have to ring you up. It's my job. I don't even need to check out. Here are the diamonds. Take as many as you want. Oh, whoa, diamonds. Oh, you can take everything. Take the whole sword. Ah, <laughs> I'm rich. What just happened? Whatever. Let's go home, vampire. All right, students, remember, no cheating in my class. Now begin your exam. Okay, okay professor. professor. <clears throat> Bro, tell me, what are you doing? Nothing, professor. There's no cheating in my class. Give me that. Oh, man. Thank you. Vampire, what are you doing here? You're not supposed to be here. I'm rich zombie security guard. I'm not doing anything. All right, well, don't help her with her exam. Okay. Broke zombie. Hey, what, professor? Oh, man. Stand up, broke zombie. Give me all your cheat sheets. Okay. Is this all of them? Yeah. Hey, vampire, I need help with this question. Okay, okay, Miss Zombie, I got you. Come on, broke zombie, I know you have more. Oh, that's all I had. Hurry up, vampire, I need the answers for number 10. Number 10? It's A. Huh? Who's that? Number 11 is C. Professor, I promise I have no more cheat sheets. I give you all of them. All right, good, Broke Zombie. Okay, Professor, I'm done. Hmm, good job, Rich Zombie. Broke Zombie, you need to be more like Rich Zombie. Learn from her. Why was she cheating too? Vampire's helping her. I was here the whole time. Just focus on your exam, Broke Zombie. Uh, you have five more minutes. Yeah. Hey, thank you, Vampire. I think I got an A. My pleasure. <sighs> What? My toothbrush is all worn out and there's no more toothpaste? Are you serious? Uh, come on, toothpaste! Yes, I knew it! I still have toothpaste! This is enough for my teeth! What? Seriously? Oh my monster, I have nothing to eat for breakfast! Just lemon? Ah, oh, oh, but I have no money! Maybe I will just eat lemon. Good morning, Miss Zombie. I'm here to serve you. I want to brush.
brush my teeth. No problem, Miss Zombie. Here you go. I have toothpaste and a golden toothbrush for you. I'm rich. I don't use regular toothpaste. No, 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 Miss Zombie. This is golden toothpaste. Let me show you. Hmm, good. Now brush my teeth. Yes, Miss Zombie. And done. Let me use the towel to clean your teeth. Your teeth look super clean now. What do you want to eat for breakfast? Mm, breakfast? I don't know. What do you have? We have Kobe beef from Japan and giant lobster from the ocean. <laughs> and lobster again? I don't want that. I want a regular breakfast. But make it fancy. What? Regular food but fancy? Do you like cereal? Oh, yes. Yes, cereal. Okay. As you wish. Okay, the zombie. Let me introduce to you golden cereal and golden milk. Okay, good. Now feed me. As you wish. Mmm. How was it, Ms. Zombie? Did it taste good? Mm, it was delicious, Vampire. Here are some diamonds for gratitude. Take as much as you want. Oh, my monster diamonds! I'm gonna be so rich! Oh, my monster! I'm rich! I'm rich! I can buy a new house! 